whether you're a boxer or a mixed martial artist, you want to compete at Madison Square Garden, the world's most famous arena. And dating to 2016, a lot of the UFC's best have gotten that opportunity. Absolutely, J.A. And when you grow up as a fighter, especially a heavyweight, it is your dream to headline MSG and fight for the heavyweight championship of the world. I got that honor, and I can almost feel the ghost of Muhammad Ali, Joe Frazier, all those great fights those guys had at MSG. I felt as if on that night that I retained my championship, I became part of that fraternity, the greatest heavyweight fighters to ever step foot in Madison Square Garden. It was an honor and a pleasure, and it felt amazing to join that fraternity. Oh, that right hand is on point. Just misses with the straight right. Ooh, what a punch. Over and over, he's landing a big body kick. Circling to his right. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Look at the turn in that kick. Nice leg kick. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Back and forth we go. Nice strike. Don't stop, don't stop. Big little kick lands under the elbow. Oh, how did he do that uppercut? Continues to mix it up, coming to the head, mixing in some body shots. Checks the leg kick. Just misses with the jet. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Look at the angle of that nice body. Punch over the top. He loaded up that guy there, too. Nice kick. Fight. Nice job to block the shot there. You got to check these low leg kicks. All right, he engages in a single poly tie here. Oh, he comes nice through with a big knee. Now they're both throwing with power. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Lands. And he landed the right hand there. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. So we cross the 30 second mark in our opening round. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. 
Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Right hands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. Good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. Here. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may float a right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Big kick lands. Liver kick. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Big body kick. Nice punch lands over the top. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. All right, single collar tie now. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Check that kick as well. That one appeared to stun him. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Just missing on the high kick there. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. It doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Wow, massive uppercut. Oh! Oh! Ooh, -wee. Ooh -wee, what a right hand by this young man. Down there as he forces the miss from his opponent. All oh, right to the mouth. Recovery, man, right back to his feet. Real nice body kick land. Nice. 
Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. There's no give on that leg kick. Seconds winding down in round two. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Five minutes to decide this one. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Oh, that's a nice strike. Unable to connect with the right. You got him whip his hip in that. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his confidence, huge strike lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed up there. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Nice straight punch. Right under the elbow of the body keep playing. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg. Nice one, two there. Ah, he's been working hard defensively. Kick block there. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Well, he hasn't really... He's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Well, what a great showcase for these two fighters. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Nice punch lands over the top. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's in something. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the 
stretch, not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. I mean, look at the commitment to kick him in this fight. Visibly limping here. Nice job by him there to get the takedown. I think that gets the Olympians' stamp of approval. Oh, yeah, absolutely. What a fantastic job of getting the takedown when you need it. Dig and kick. Oh! Use hurts. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite strike in the round. Oh, he's done. He's done. He's done. Oh, Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. Bruce Buffer now has...